homelessness, drug abuse, and the devastating opioid crisis have intertwined in a gripping battle that continues to haunt the streets of America. In particular, Kensington Avenue in Philadelphia has become a notorious epicenter of this crisis. The neighborhood is plagued by unsanitary conditions with garbage lined streets and a lack of access to basic amenities for the unhoused population. The opioid crisis in America has reached alarming proportions, impacting individuals from all walks of life. According to the Centers of Disease Control and Prevention, from 1999 to 2019, over 450,000 lives were lost due to opioid-related overdoses, with over 70% of all overdose deaths involving opioids. These numbers paint a grim picture of the ongoing battle against addiction and its devastating consequences. In Philadelphia, Kensington Avenue has become a symbol of the deep-rooted issues of homelessness and drug addiction. This once vibrant neighborhood now faces the harsh reality of rampant drug use and staggering rates of homelessness. Desperation and addiction drives individuals to seek refuge in the oblivion of substance abuse, leading to a devastating cycle that seems insurmountable. Xalazine, a veterinary tranquilizer commonly used for horses, has recently emerged as a troubling component of the opioid crisis. This sedative is often found mixed with fentanyl and heroin, amplifying their potency and lethality. As a non-opiate substance, xylazine compounds the dangers of drug abuse, making it difficult for users to predict their tolerance levels, resulting in a higher risk of overdose.
What makes Xalazine particularly dangerous is that users often do not realize that they have consumed it until their skin starts to decompose, resulting in severe complications. Unlike opioids, xylazine can render a person unconscious for several days and the standard opioid overdose reversal medication, Narcon, is not effective against it. The only treatment option currently available is supportive care, including the use of oxygen tanks to address respiratory depression caused by xylazine. One of the primary reasons for the popularity of xylazine, fentanyl, and heroin mixtures lies in their ease of availability and affordability. The illicit market offers these substances at relatively low prices, making them attractive to individuals struggling with addiction and seeking relief from their pain and suffering. Coupled with the accessibility of these drugs, especially in areas like Kensington Avenue, the cycle of abuse becomes even harder to break. One of the challenges in combating the crisis is the legal ambiguity surrounding xylazine. Since it is intended for veterinary use and not approved for human consumption, it falls into a gray area and is not classified as a controlled substance. However, the U.S. Drug Enforcement Administration is aware of its dangers and recently issued a nationwide report on the risk associated with its combination with illicit drugs.
fentanyl, a synthetic opioid 50 times more potent than heroin, has played a pivotal role in exacerbating the opioid crisis. Often disguised as heroin or mixed with it, fentanyl increases the risk of overdose exponentially. According to the National Institute on Drug Abuse, in 2019, approximately 80% of fentanyl-related overdose deaths involved other substances like heroin, cocaine, or methamphetamine. This dangerous combination is a legal trap that ensnares unsuspected users, leading to tragic outcomes. Drug use is a multifaceted phenomenon that has persisted throughout human history, encompassing a wide range of substances with varying effects on individuals. In the face of mounting evidence highlighting the harmful consequences, it remains perplexing why people continue to use drugs like xylazine, heroin, and fentanyl despite their known detrimental impact on health and well-being. One of the primary motivations for drug use is the desire to escape from emotional pain, stress, trauma, or a sense of overwhelming reality. Drugs can offer temporary respite from personal troubles, 
creating a soothing and euphoric state that helps individuals cope with their inner struggles. While these substances may provide temporary relief, they often exacerbate the underlying issues leading to a vicious cycle of dependence and addiction. Genetic and biological factors can also contribute to drug use patterns. Certain individuals may have a predisposition to addiction due to genetic factors that affect their brain chemistry and response to drugs. The referred effects of substances like heroin and fentanyl can lead to rapid addiction, as the brain associates drug use with intense pleasure, creating a powerful reward-seeking cycle that is difficult to break. For some individuals, the allure of drugs may stem from a lack of viable alternatives to address their needs and desires. Limited access to education, employment, opportunities, healthcare, and support systems can create a sense of hopelessness and desperation. In such circumstances, drugs may be perceived as a readily available means of experiencing pleasure, relief, or an escape from challenging realities. Homelessness remains an enduring and complex issue in America. Behind the alarming statistics and heartbreaking stories, 
lie a multitude of interconnected causes that contribute to this societal challenge. One of the primary drivers of homelessness is the scarcity of affordable housing. As housing costs continues to rise, particularly in urban areas, many low-income individuals and families find themselves unable to afford stable and secure housing. Limited affordable housing options force people to make difficult choices between paying for rent, utilities, and other basic necessities, often leading to eviction and homelessness. Homelessness is closely linked to economic inequality and poverty. A significant portion of the population struggles with low wages, unstable employment, or lack of job opportunities. For those living on the margins of society, a sudden job loss, medical emergency, or other unexpected expenses can push them into homelessness. Insufficient social safety nets and inadequate support systems exacerbate the vulnerability of individuals and families facing economic hardships. Mental health issues and substance abuse disorders contribute significantly to homelessness.
Many individuals experiencing homelessness suffer from mental illnesses such as schizophrenia, bipolar disorder, or depression. Limited access to mental health services, stigma, and the high cost of treatment often leave these individuals without the support they need, increasing their risk of becoming homeless. Substance abuse, which can be both a cause and a consequence of homelessness, further compounds the problem by impairing social functioning and exacerbating personal challenges.